record heat wave caused dozens of Aztec fans to seek medical help during SDSU's football game this past Saturday. ABC 10 News reporter Nia Watson shows us how the sweltering temperatures impacted the big day and what the university plans to do moving forward. We just had the hottest football game in the 100 year history of Aztec football. SDSU's historic opening of Snapdragon Stadium overshadowed by Saturday's record heat wave. It's not something that we traditionally see. This TikTok by an Aztec fan shows hundreds of people huddled together on the shaded concourse, desperate to keep cool as temperatures stretched into the 90s. SDSU Athletics Director John David Wicker says they provided cooling stations throughout the stadium and passed out free water during the game. We had, you know, fogging machines, one for the players, uh, but on the concourse we had multiple places where you could um, uh, get into the, I think it was big fog cool zones. But would kick off at 1230 in the afternoon, the heat proved to be too much for some fans. I think we had somewhere in the neighborhood of 200 uh, medical requests uh, during the game. Uh, obviously the overwhelming majority of those were uh, related to the heat. Wicker adds he estimates between 20 to 30 people were taken to the hospital. But despite the heat, Wicker says he believes fans were able to enjoy the game as much as they could. We still felt good about the turnout. We still felt you know, good about how the building operated. He says he doesn't expect future games to have similar issues since most are late afternoon or evening games. But he says Saturday was a learning experience. Going forward, if we know we're going to run into something like that, we now have a plan for what it looks like when it's, you know, 100 degrees at 1230. In Mission Valley, Neil Watson, ABC 10 News. And Falk, the city's ambulance provider, says its call volume was up 122% over normal on Saturday.